Hello guys and welcome back to the crazy Minecraft video where today I'm going to be showing you guys something really awesome. Now Mark my friendly zombie has gone ahead and woken us up very early in the morning. Mark it's 9 o'clock, usually I'm in bed till 10. Well let's go and find out what we're doing today. Mark where are you my friendly zombie? Hmm it's very unusual for Mark my friendly zombie not to be waiting outside her house. I only see Marie our friendly zombie and also baby zombie. Baby zombie do you know what's going on today? <laughs> what do you mean you saw a thief last night? Hmm, that's very unusual. Well, let's go speak to Marie and find out what's going on. Hello, Naveed. Have you seen Mark? Do you know what, Marie? I actually haven't, and I was just looking for him myself. So hopefully, he's doing okay. He hasn't come out of his house today, and I'm a little worried. I would really appreciate if you can go and check up on him. Do you know what? I would love to do that. Well, let's go and do this. Let's go inside Mark our friendly zombie's house and find out what's going on because Mark my friendly zombie is usually out by this time. Hopefully, he's not dead. Mark, where are you? So he's not downstairs and I think he might be upstairs. Oh, there he is. <laughs> Mark, put some clothes on. You're naked. That is disgusting. It's already 10.30 and it seems like Mark my friendly zombie isn't even dressed. He doesn't even want to look at me. He's so embarrassed. Hello, Naveed. Someone has stolen my clothes. I don't know why they would do such a thing. I can't go outside like this. I will burn up really quick. Wait, maybe that's why Baby Zombie went ahead and told us that he saw a thief last night. That makes complete sense. Help me so I can get you a decent reward. Do you know what? I would love to do that. Well, guys, let's do this. Let's go and find out where Mark our friendly zombie's clothes have gone, and hopefully, whoever's taken it can be punished. I just hope it's not a villager because I hate killing villagers. Hopefully, with our wonderful items, we should go ahead and get his clothes back. Marie, baby zombie, don't you guys worry. Mark our friendly zombie has had his clothes stolen, and I'll go ahead and get them all back. Well, let's head to the villagers and find out if they know what's going on. So guys, I'll be back in a few minutes once I've made my way to the village. Okay, we've almost made it to the village, and I can already see all the villagers worried about something. So I have a feeling the thief has actually come through here. Hello, villager. Aww. Have you seen a thief? He stole Mark my friendly zombie's clothes, and I have a feeling he could be really dangerous. Because if he's willing to take clothes, what else is he willing to steal? Yes, we found the thief. He is in this village, somewhere. Ah, oh, this is going to be awful. Looking for this thief is going to be really hard. He can literally be inside any house. Hello? Oh, it looks like someone has stolen all the furniture from this house. So no thief in these houses. How about around here? I don't seem to see anything. And it seems like there could even be some villagers stuck inside this house. So I think maybe I've saved a few people. Hey, how's it going? Hopefully you should be able to get out of the house now. Well, let's go look for these villagers. And hopefully one of them will turn out to be the thief. So it seems like everyone is trying to guide me to a very unusual place. But I'm not sure if they're trying to help me find the thief. Or if they're just trying to get their items back. So this house is empty. Let's go up here and see if we can find him. Hello? Has anyone seen a thief? Oh, I think this guy has. Where is he? Oh, he's in the house behind me. Let's go have a quick look. Yes, I think I see him. Let's go look for the other window. Let's have a quick look. Oh, I think he's in there. Okay, let's do this. Die, evil thief, die. Why have you taken all these items? So it seems like he's stolen a diamond, an emerald, an air element, some hamburgers, and also Mark our friendly zombie's clothes, his full diamond chest plate, and also his emerald leggings. This is awful. You must die for this. I just really hope he's a friendly guy. Wait, I think he's actually evil. I think he's trying to kill me and hopefully get rid of me, and then we won't be able to get rid of him. Okay, let's do this. Perfect. <laughs> this might be the only way we can actually go ahead and kill him, because it seems like he's not as smart to know that when I close this door, he can't reach me. There we go. <laughs> I'm not sure how many more hits it's going to take, but I hope we can actually kill him very soon. Perfect. Good. Come on. How many more hearts does this guy have? Yes, we've done it. Villagers, we've done it. We've saved the village. Or at least I think we have. Let me go and help this villager because I can see him stuck inside this well. And the poor guy will be stuck in here for life if he doesn't have my help. Let's go and do this. Come on. Almost there and perfect. There you go, villager. You're free. Well, now that we killed this thief, I do need to go and find out who all these items belong to. So, these diamonds belong to someone. So does this emerald. This air element must belong to some sort of witch. And we've got loads of food that I think belongs to Zombie Matty. And then the outfit for Mark our friendly zombie. Perfect. Let's go and do this. Hello, villager. Do you know who this belongs to? Oh, you do? Who? 
Oh, okay, perfect. So I have to go and find the chest that this belongs to. So it seems like in one of these houses, there will be a chest that we go ahead and put this in, which I think will be a wonderful thing. Anything in here? Hmm. Or maybe my best option is just to go ahead and actually leave this with any villager, and they can go and find the owners. Because all villagers are super friendly, which I think is wonderful. Do you know what, guys? I'm just going to put one inside here, another one inside there, and then I might just chuck the rest around here. And hopefully, whoever's had it stolen will go ahead and find it. Well, I think the rest of these items belong to everyone else. And hopefully, we can go and find out what's happening. Because this air element must belong to some sort of witch. But I don't want to give the witch anything back because she's evil. Do you know what? Let's just leave this right there. And let's head back to Mark our friendly zombie and find out who these items belong to. Okay, we made it back to our village, and it does seem like everything should belong to everyone right here. But the first person we should go and give our items back to is Mark, our friendly zombie. Mark, I got them back. Hopefully, you're really happy about this. So I've gone ahead and gotten your diamond chest blade and also your emerald leggings. Guys, don't look. Mark, my friendly zombie is about to get changed. Oh, are you done? Perfect. Gosh, Mark, you look wonderful. Hopefully, now you can actually go ahead and tell Marie that you're actually doing great. Well guys, I'm not really sure who these diamonds belong to, but it doesn't seem like there's any chest in here that we could go ahead and leave it with. So what I'm going to do is leave this for Mark to go ahead and give it back to his rightful owner. Mark, is that okay with you? Perfect, I'm glad. Hopefully the villagers won't be upset that I've gone ahead and taken all the items from the thief's chest. Well, I do think Zombie Matty belongs to all these items. Because every single time I actually go to Zombie Matty's house, he's got so much food. Which I would love to go ahead and try out one day. Marie, I did it. We went ahead and actually helped our Mark our friendly zombie find out where his whole outfit went. Which I think was wonderful. Well, let's go speak to Zombie Matty and find out if all this food belongs to him. I'd love to go ahead and give it. Zombie Matty, is this okay? Is this all your food? Because if it is, I would love to give it back. Oh, everything except the nether cake. Cool. Well, let's go and do this. Let me check in all these items. See, Zombie Matty has cooked kebabs. He has pork chops, chicken, random swords. And now he has hot dogs, cheesy bread, and also loads of hamburgers. And that means... All these nether cakes are for us to go ahead and eat, which I think is wonderful. So guys, let's do this. I'm going to put them all outside my house and share them with baby zombie. And hopefully we can all eat them up, which I think will be yummy. Here you go. That's for you. And this one's for zombie Marie. And then this one can be for me. Yes. And let's go and eat it. Hmm. Nice. <laughs> but I did wish it would give us some sort of special effects, which I don't think it would actually go ahead and give us. But maybe one day we can actually make this ourselves once we know the recipe. Baby zombie, is this yours? <laughs> yep, I've never tried the nether cake either, which I think is wonderful. Well, guys, I'm so glad today we found the thief and we got back everyone their items. But sadly, the time has now come for us to go ahead and leave everyone to go back to their own homes with their wonderful cakes. And hopefully, we'll never see this thief ever again, because I did kill him. Well, guys, I will see you soon another crazy Minecraft video. And don't forget to like this video, subscribe down below the button is red, and don't forget to press the notifications bell. And as Mark, my friendly zombie would say, <laughs> which means, peace out. So, guys, I'll see you all soon. Peace out.